This video will cover documents added to a project. If you have a yellow cylinder, that means the document is added to the project. If we have a cat's icon, that means that the document is not added to the project at the moment. If you wish to add your documents to the project, you can press the yellow cylinder with an arrow to add it. This will generate new unique IDs to devices and cables. Centers in this example are matched with the ones already in the project. We can also add additional documents to the project. In this case, DB101. If you wish to open the project folder, you can press Ctrl E or right click and open drawing directory. All files belonging to the project must be in one project folder. Here we see the DB file, the centralized data management. If you wish to rename a document added to the project, only do this in the database. Here we can go to the Documents tab, and here it's safe to rename the document. Select Document 2001 and choose Rename from Context menu. If we want to remove a document from the project, select it, right-click and select Remove Document. This will let us remove all wires, cables, etc. that has to do with the document 2002. If a document is accidentally deleted from the project folder before it was removed from the project, use clean up project function to update information in the database to solve the problem. Let's open the drawing directory. Now we can see that the document is renamed. If we go to file 2002, we can see that it's no longer connected to the project. The document can now be permanently deleted in the project folder. If necessary, sync changes from database to update project tree. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us.